All right, now we're doing free code camp, new responsive web design, learn HTML by building a cat photo app, step 57. Now we're gonna add the name attribute with the value personality to the checkbox input element. While we won't notice this in the browser, doing this makes it easier for a server to process our web form, especially when there are multiple checkboxes. All right, so uh, basically, looks like we're just gonna put a name attribute right here and say uh, name equals and then uh, personality let's see if that works test it out all right there we go and uh, I guess this is gonna do something I guess we got to remember this for something all right uh, for web form servers whatever all right so submit it and now we're on uh, step 58 and we'll see you next time